So what happens when you come in to see a, me? I can talk about what happens when you come in to see me or someone in my yes, practice. Yes, please, yes. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so what happens is we have a conversation and, and it's really about like, okay, you know, your, your young person is going to give me information, um, some of which will come when you're present and some of it will come when you are not present. Um, that's really important. What I've found is that yes. in general, young people do not share the extent of their gender distress with their parents. They yes. are very protective by nature um, and, and they've been navigating it for a long time, right? And so like, this is just an example, right? You know, I've had a handful of people come in um, and, you know, be talking about, well, how do you manage this is, I don't mean to make everything about bathrooms. But this is a great example of something that you'd be astonished if you found out as a parent, right? How, I say to the kid, how are you managing the bathrooms at school? Oh no, I, I just don't, I don't drink any liquids until 2 p.m. So I can come home and use bathroom, right? Um, I just don't use the bathroom. Parents are like, what are you talking about? You know, 